The M4A3E2 Sherman Jumbo is what happens when America remembers that the Sherman isn't the best tank of the war. So they make it better by slapping a shit ton of armor on it and calling it a day. They made two versions. The light version known as the M4A3E8EZ8 Sherman and the heavy version. The M4A3E2 Sherman Jumbo. Today I will be talking about the Sherman Jumbo, or more accurately, how to not drive this thing like a monkey. The first rule of the Jumbo is never touch the fucking turret. If you want to mount the upgraded turret go play an EZ8. The upgraded turret weighs less and gives you more HP and view range, but much less armor. However, the stock turret gives you 152mm of armor on all sides, meaning that you will bounce anything. Your hull armor is 101mm thick which is enough to bounce most guns at your tier but it usually requires a good amount of angling to bounce large caliber guns. When angling the jumbo, you have to make sure not to expose your sides too much because they are very thin and you will get penetrated harder than the girl on your other monitor. Fortunately, the jumbo has a very large health pool that allows room for mistakes. So if you fuck up like the autistic retard you are, you can correct your mistake and keep fighting. You are not very fast, but you have mobility decent enough to make sure that you can get to the battle quickly. This also means that you can activate and effectively use anti-flanking maneuvers to ensure that you don't get fucked over by some cunt in a French autoloader. As for firepower you can only use the 76mm M1A1 on the stock turret but that doesn't matter because you still have good damage, but very bad reloading and subpar penetration. In a way, the jumbo is just like the Super Pershing's little brother. You need to get used to the slow turret traverse to help you snatch off tanks and like the Super Pershing. You only have armor on your front. Your sides are weak as shit and they will get penetrated if you don't heavily angle them. To prepare the jumbo, you preheat the oven to 180 degrees, and sprinkle some salt on it from all the tanks you bounced. To prepare the jumbo, you load a lot of AP, some skill rounds to trigger unicums and some HE to fuck over paper panzers harder than the US government fucks over its people. For consumables you load a multi-purpose kit, a repair kit, and adrenaline. For equipment you load a rammer, optics, a gun laying drive, improved armor, improved control, V-stabs, a toolbox and whatever other shitty equipment you want. This is the correct way to play the M4A3E2 Sherman Jumbo. Go out there, and plunder the Middle East for oil.